Joshua Sharks. My name is Joshua Eslard. I'm here from Fort Lauderdale, Florida, and I'm the inventor of the Cut Buddy. Today I'm seeking $300,000 in exchange for 10% of my company. Woo! Sharks. And you know what? Cutting your own hair. Damon, you ever cut your own hair? I have. Cutting your own hair, that's no easy task. One wrong move, and it can all be over. But you know what? It doesn't have to be this way, because I created the solution. It's called the Cut Buddy. Here you go, brother. Use this instead, all right? The Cut Buddy is the first <laughs> multi-curve hair grooming guide tool that allows you to edge up and shape up your beard lines and your hairlines perfectly and quickly. With three curves and three straight edges, you can look great regardless of your head shape or your hair size. Who wants to cut a deal? Uh. So why don't you give us sales for 2016 and what you project for 2017 to help me get over the hump on this $3 million value. My sales for 2016 were $700,000. Yes, sir! Get out of here! 60,000 units. Yep, oh, 60, yeah, 60,000 units How did you sell 60,000 units? I found some affiliates on YouTube that had a heavy following doing videos for hair, and all of a sudden, my sales went from 20 sales per day to 100, 200, 400 sales per day, and I went viral on Facebook, hit 11 million views. Wow. What do you sell it for? I sell it at $14.95. What does it cost you? It's $2 and with the And what is packaging. retail? Is it hair places like Sally's, or is it Walgreens, CVS, or all? I met with Sally's. Uh, I'm just waiting, basically, for them to offer me a PO. So I'm prepared to make you an offer. I'll give you the $300,000. What I want is $1.50 from every unit until I've made back a Milski. Basically just over three times on my money, then it goes away. And just so I can keep my interest in you, I want 5% of the company. Josh, I'll throw oh, a Josh, sweetener in. I'll throw a, a sweetener in. If you do this deal with me, I'll grow my hair back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Just you know, declare the deck, I'm out. I could have helped you rebillionize. Rebillionize? <laughs> ah. That's a good one. Josh, I think it's a good product. I don't, I don't really understand it, to be honest with you. I'm out. I, I honestly think that this will be as common as a comb in your house in Maybe. the next five years. I'm all right with that. But I made you an offer, and you're still talking to people that don't seem that excited. Damon, I see you're quiet. And is there any way that you and Kevin would work together in this? What, work with Kevin? Why would I do that? I mean, he's a beautiful I guy. have more hair than he has. <laughs> you know, I've got an offer for you. I'll offer you uh, $300,000 for 20%. There are, to me, traits to a great entrepreneur. Drive, passion, not giving up. You have all of those traits to Thank do you. all these different things, as they said. But you also have two good offers here, so I'm out. So Josh, three sharks out, two offers on the table. What are you going to do? Damon, is there any way that you'd go to 12.5%? Oh. I like that about you, but I would normally be at 33%. 300,000 for 20%, I think, is fair. It gets me excited. I go out there and I, I do whatever you need me to do. Um, Damon, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to ride with you. Oh, man. That offer down because um, it, it wasn't anything against Mr. Wonderful, really. Um, actually, I appreciate him offering me something out the gate because it allowed others to be more interesting. But I didn't I didn't totally think he understood the demographic that I was approaching at the time. Uh, and Damon kind of understood that world a little more the the urban uh, multicultural demographic. But in hindsight, when I look back at it, because now I sell uh, bald shavers and things uh, for bald people, because I'm bald now. <laughs> um, maybe Mr. Wonderful would have worked out as well, you know? Um, but also the the um, the royalty was kind of a very long hold on to my company. But uh, they both, both deals had pros and cons. I just thought that the partner was Damon, because that was my idol, read all his books, wore FUBU as a kid. And that's who I went on the show to be with. That's really... That's what I was targeted on when I got there. <laughs>